Here's Judy. Does an outstanding job kind of dictating their offense at times. Spencer a three. And the Camels on the board with the transfer from Holmes Community College. Trey Spencer. Want to be able to stop Miami from getting their easy looks right now. Here's Lawrence. Quick trigger and Anthony Lawrence ties the game. Anthony Lawrence has been one of those guys also throughout his years here in Miami. Clemens already had two uncontested looks, not something that's in Miami that you want to give him a lot of as the game progresses. Likes. Pushes Miami to the lead on his 19th three of the year. This game moving more to Miami's pace than Campbell's? Yeah, and I think what it is is that Miami's able to get their sets as a nice little jump move by Izumundu. Ion Williamson of Duke better shooting shots from the floor than Ibuka Azundu here in the early campaign. Vasilievich, and here is Johnson on the floor for the first time. Difficult for the Camels to get anything going. And it was ironic, too. One of the things that he talked about, and you worry about some teams come out of break, you see Anthony Lawrence with a little up and under for the basket. Double team coming against Udy. Gensler the catch. And the score. Corey Gensler the basket. Well, you see, outside of Florida. Well, what you said, like the, the basket by Gensler. And he plays with Spencer, Udy, and the freshman Chapman. And there's the drive and the basket. Here's Likes. Mack. And Johnson a step back three. Zach Johnson was six on a pair of triple. The Canes, I think, have come up with an interesting... The double team of Udy has helped them at the defensive end of the floor and now Zach Johnson's given them nine off the bench. Three guards with Mack and Azundu. Really almost four guards. Here's Like skips from Mack. A three. And it's good for Anthony Mack. Miami's got 23 points on two runs. One of 14 points and one of nine. And here's a three by Chapman to snap the Miami streak. In the corner, Gensler. And the three will drop in for Corey Gensler. Seven to shoot for Likes in Miami, who've got a nine-point lead. Chris Likes a step back. Three is good on Clemens. Mm. That's a tough shot. They have a little dog. I mean, Chris Likes is one of those guys that I think that as you've seen him play in his years here, is that <laughs> little guys battle. Clemens coming back. Chris Likes has taken this, this challenge and is going at him. Here's Gensler off the turnover and Nelson the foot oh and the foul oh on Johnson. So, Wes, did we talk about Nelson was that guy that could go upstairs? And you see the turnover here. Great pass to hit by Gensler. And you see, oh my, my goodness. And I love the fact that you go for the and one. Seven point lead for Miami. Azundu back for likes through traffic and score. Great next recognition by Azundu when he got the ball on the side. Miami got off to a really good start. And was led by as many as 14 in this first half. The lead is nine in the Zundu, the flush. And Clemens turns and burns for Campbell. Spots up at the foul line and scores. Five for Clemens. Baseline goes likes. Lost the handle on it. Here's Gensler. Now Clemens open floor, and he'll lay it in. Well, to your point, Brian, with Nelson defending. Runner is good. Likes gets the bounce. And Chris Likes now with 11 in the first half leads all school. Undu in the post. Now Lawrence fights through and dumps it. Seven for Lawrence on his third field goal. It's interesting how Miami is kind of compensating for the lack of bigs as Likes buries another one. Now Udy was six. They're waiting on Clemens. Right back to Udy for a two. Got it. Andrew Udy's first points, and that'll get us to halftime. It's an 11-point Miami lead, Brian. There is Likes. Lawrence and the Hurricanes. Vasilia Mitchell's arch one and score. So one of the things we didn't talk about. I beg your pardon. That's his first basket of the game. And there's the shot. Udy has put back-to-back -back hoops together. Brian, these are the type games concern coaches because you said this at the top. You're coming off the break. You're getting ready for conference play. Something most teams have four or five days. They take two, three days off from practice. And the G-man coming up for you tomorrow. Here's Likes all the way to the iron. 
How about 16 this? for likes. One of the things we talk about that he brings to this team outside of the scoring, an athletic guy that can play defense. Likes buries another one. 19 now for likes. Early in the year, largest lead of the ball game now for Miami. Spencer out of the corner, that time good. Second field goal, both threes for Trey Spencer. Cluxton working against Azundu, spots Nelson. And Jacor Nelson now with a three. He's got nine in the ball game. Likes working against Nelson. Here's Lawrence on the drive and a layup. Nelson threw it away to Johnson. Zach Johnson step back three at the top, rattles it in. A dozen for Zach Johnson on four threes, Brian. That he can do a lot more things. He's made him a more valuable piece for Larry Nagel's bus. Johnson tried to feed it inside. Here's Nelson with the turnover. And the strong take for Jacor Nelson. Vasiljevic, here's Wardenberg, who is still scoreless today. Back to Lawrence for the layup. Nice pass by Wardenberg to be able to get Lawrence in the back door. That last time Miami having three guys on Clemens seems a little frustrated because of the, the strength and the height. And how about Zach Johnson saying he's feeling finished it, feeling it today. 55 to 40. Udy backing down on Wardenberg, and Udy will turn and score. Eight points for Andrew Udy. And now they go back and forth with not much success. And Vasilievich off the Johnson pass. Nice finish by Vasilievich. If you see his game was, he's that guy that's real steady. Mm -hmm. uh, doesn't force it. Uh, plays with himself. Good read by Johnson. Yep. Wardenberg his first basket. Um, only one loss, and that was to Vill uh, Villanova. Um, and I think that every night you see, you see good basket by Clemens. And he's 6-2 and two all time against current members of the Big South. Here's DJ Vasilievich for a two. Rebounding numbers not as skewed as one might suspect. Well, what has changed here today is the dynamic defense on the perimeter that Miami's played. UD knocks down the jump shot. He's got 14. Again, you talk about a guy his size playing against point guards, and I like a, a Ben Simmons that's 6'10". You have to be able to do something extremely well as I cue it up for him to knock down that three. Yep. And so now your team becomes that much more prepared. And we talked about with Miami over the years, this is a team that's always right there in contention. Clemens on a runner. Now has 15 in the game. So 21 of 22 now on the year is Vasilevich at the line. Clemens trying to split that double and will scoop and score. Chris Clemens has now got 19, by the way. Here's Udy. Now Clemens for 20. And won't get it. The tap by Nelson with two and a half left. So Jacor Nelson will get the final points of the ball game. And Miami will win 73 to 62.